Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and thank you for watching. My name is Paige and for today's video we are doing my first vlog, first official vlog. I'm so excited. I just got a new camera. Thank you Matt so much. He bought me this camera for my graduation so I'm super excited to get vlogging. Um, I thought it'd be a good idea to take you guys along of my week, see what's going on. My life isn't that interesting but I did want to show you guys what's up and what I do every day just to give you guys a little insight on what I do because we're friends, let's be real. Right now, I just did my hair and makeup. It's Tuesday, by the way. Mondays are kind of a write-off for me because I'm so busy with work. Um, but I did my hair. I used the Dyson Airwrap today, the longer, sorry, the bigger barrel. So I did that. Looks pretty good. And I just did a quick, quick makeup. Can't be bothered with putting on makeup during the week, but I did put on a little bit today. So right now I need to get ready because I'm going to UPS to drop off some packages. And then I'm going to Matt's house later because tonight, I think it's today. I think it's today. Um, it's his brother's girlfriend's birthday. So we're just going to celebrate, have some dinner. And I really hope there's cake because I could go for some cake. But yeah, so let's get ready. I need to get dressed. Also guys, I don't know about you, let me know if you guys like dress up to work from home because I basically wear this every single day. I'm wearing my Walmart sweatpants right now, this oversized uh, crew neck from Misguided which is actually really really nice. I think this is my favorite sweater right now and my fuzzy slippers from Amazon that my friends got me for my birthday. I look like a hobo. Let's fix this. <laughs> Okay, so this is what I ended up wearing today, minus the slippers. I'll probably throw on combat boots or something. Um, I've been so uninspired with outfits lately. I don't know what it is. I'm just not down currently. I was wearing this white sweater from Oakenfort. It was 20 bucks in the sales section. Can't go wrong. And I'm wearing my favorite Levi's wedgie straights and just this little necklace I have. Really basic. It'll look better with combat boots, but... Yeah, that's what I'm wearing. Stop doing that. Say hello, guys. She's so fuzzy. She's going to get a haircut. Say hi, everyone. I'm tired. Oh, she's giving you kisses. <laughs> oh, what a nice angle. Throwing this in. Don't have that much time today. Ooh. Okay, cool. All right. Already not off to a good start, clearly. Let's see what's up. Also, never driven in combat boots before. No Does anyone else, like... Okay. Does anyone else have, like, one pair of shoes that you just drive in? You're like, these are my driving shoes. Because I feel like I can only drive in running shoes. But I've never tried driving in anything else. So... Should be fun. UPS isn't that far. Whatever, we'll be fine. Okay, back from UPS. That actually wasn't bad at all. Found a close parking spot. It was all good. Now it's pretty much the end of the day. It's 420. 420 glaze it. And yeah, now I'm just chilling in my car. Honestly, chilling in my car sometimes is like calming. And I'm currently sweating in this puffer jacket. Not gonna lie. So today's Tuesday. Yesterday was Monday, which means it was dancing with the stars like this video if you watch dance with the stars because that's one of my favorite shows recently last night Derek cuff who's literally my favorite did a duet with his girlfriend and i think they're my new favorite couple ever she's so pretty she looks gorgeous and them dancing together they're both amazing they're so talented it was so good tonight's the bachelorette and i went to matt's house so i really hope we can like put it on because i don't want to miss it this is actually my first time ever watching the bachelorette but since you know it's like covid and there's nothing else to watch really i was like you know what i'm gonna give it a shot there's a lot of drama like i already feel like claire cries every two seconds let me know if you agree she cries over everything and then she's obsessed with this dale fellow who is really cute but also i feel like he's fishy something's up with him I don't know what it is, but he's fishy to me, even though they're probably engaged now, but that's just my two cents. So I think now I'll chill for like five minutes, see if there's any other things I need to do for work, and then I'll go to Matt's house. What's up, guys? Let me move you back. What's up, guys? Okay, so back at home now. Um, dinner was amazing. I'm so full. I literally unbuckled my jeans while I was driving home because I'm that full. Anyways, gonna wash my face now, so I thought I'd show you guys quickly um my current nighttime routine i'm doing like a deep hydration tonight because 
my skin's been really dry and my lips have been really dry and basically the past few weeks my eyes have been getting really dry and irritated and i've been trying to figure out what it was so first i thought it was my ole hendrix eye cream so i returned that and got another eye cream wasn't that and then i don't know what it was and i thought it was this makeup remover the garnier micellular water thing i don't know because my eyes were fine and then the other day when i went to go take off my makeup with this my eyes were irritated again so i think it's that so we're gonna use something else to take off my makeup today and it's my sister's but she said I could use it. And it's this pharmacy green clean makeup melt away. That, I don't know, we're, we're gonna use it until I find a new makeup remover. If you have any nice makeup removers that you like, comment down below. I put on my headband. Oh, you can see me, hey guys. Okay, so this is fancy. My sister has fancy skincare and she said I could use this so I hope she doesn't get mad. I only need a little bit. I'm not wearing that much makeup. That's more than enough. Okay. How do I put this back now? My eyes are so dry, guys. Ow. I can that mascara off. That's a look. Okay, let's rinse that. So I washed my face with my new cleanser, it's the CeraVe Hydrating Cleanser. I was using this and I thought this had something to do with my um, dry eyes as well. So I picked this up from Walmart because everyone says they love it. So I'm going to try that. And then I used my Foreo just to scrub all that makeup off anymore. That makeup remover seemed to work. My skin feels pretty clean. I'm going to do my eye cream. So since I've returned the Ole Hendrickson eye cream, I picked up the Kiehl's Creamy Eye Treatment. It's like the avocado one. I used to use this a long time ago and it was just like plain and simple, easy. So I'm gonna use some of this. I literally had to put like ice packs on my eyes, cold compress to like help with the swelling and the redness. And I haven't changed anything with my routine like in the past, so I'm not sure. I'm just trying to figure out what it is. And then just to hydrate my skin even more, I'm using my Summer Fridays jet lag mask. Almost out of this, definitely buying a new one when the Sephora sale comes. It took me a while to warm up to this mask, but I love it now. It's so hydrating. I know people who use this as a regular moisturizer. Wouldn't go that far. But I do like using this like one to two times a week. And then the last step, I'm just gonna put some good old Vaseline on my lips because my lips are dry and the skin around my lips is dry. So I'm just gonna use this. I also, random, I saw a TikTok today that a girl said that her biology teacher or something said that the best moisturizer you could use is Vaseline. I don't know about that. But it is a secret weapon for like lips and I know like dry feet. Oh clean. I feel very fresh now. I needed that. It's almost bedtime. Your girl is a grandma and goes to bed early. I just can't. I am going to just go on Pinterest and get some inspo for some outfits because I've been feeling pretty uninspired lately and I want to get some content. So I'm going to do that. Watch some friends or how I met your mother and go to sleep. So I will see you guys tomorrow. What's up guys? Happy Wednesday. I'm so tired today, honestly. Um, it's really gloomy and cloudy and gross outside. So you already know I'm not down to like do anything today, but there is a few things I have to do. I have to go to a vendor's area and pick up some stuff and then drop some stuff off um, at an influencer's place. So I'm gonna do that today. My room is a mess right now, so I'm gonna try and clean it up. It's literally a pigsty and I'm sick of it. And I try to clean it every day. It just doesn't go as planned. So I'm really going to try to get today because I'm really sick of the mess. And yeah, I really hope it's a chill day. I'm tired. This weather is getting to me. I honestly just want to be Betsy in my next life because she has been sleeping all morning in my bed. And she's very cuddly. She's just enjoying life. Say hi, guys. I'm sleeping. I'll see you guys later. Just got home. That took about an hour to go to the vendor's house. Basically with my job, if some vendors for 
the company I work for, um, are based in Toronto or like the GTA. I will drive um, and go pick that up just because it's like easier than shipping it. And same with influencers, like if they're in the city, I'll just like drop it off at their house because it's way easier. So I went to this vendor's house. It was about like half an hour away. And as you could tell, like I look like poo right now. And I got to this girl's house. It was a really nice area. And she wasn't bougie, but she looked like so put together. And I looked like this. And I was like, hi. But she was really sweet. And she packaged everything up for me. Like, I don't even have to pack anything. Uh, which makes my life easier. Now I'm starving because it's like 1 o'clock. And I guess I'll go eat lunch. Do some things on the computer. And then run to UPS and influencers or whatever I have to do. And I want to work out today if possible. Basically last week I was horrible with working out. I have a Peloton and I broke my 17 week streak because it was a lazy ass last week and didn't work out. So that's embarrassing and annoying. So I have to start all over again and I'm on a one week streak now because I worked out um, yesterday and Monday. So I'll work out today. But um, yeah, like I said before, my life isn't that interesting. I'll try my best to make it interesting. Like, I was going to go to Starbucks today, and then the way I went home, I didn't pass the Starbucks. I thought it was going to pass by. So, really not the plan I was trying to have for this vlog. Basically, my day was going pretty good. You know, it got a little sunny outside, so my mood got a little better. And I went to my co-worker's house to drop up some stuff, and I just went up to her apartment to say hi, like five minutes. And then I came back downstairs to my car, and I got a parking ticket. This is actually my first parking ticket ever. I'm very good with my parking. I always park legally. There was no signs or anything saying that I couldn't park there, but I came out to a $50 ticket, which isn't that much, but I just get kind of annoyed like wasting money on stupid shit like that. Um, so that kind of ruined my day, but we're fine. Minor setback, we're good. Didn't work out, classic page. Um, but I did drink my water. This is my big water bottle from Amazon. Almost done for the day. I filled it up all the way to the top to set my intentions for the day and drink all my water and it's going pretty well. But I'm very happy that it's the end of the day so I can rest. Today went by very quickly. I'm going to do the, this mask tonight. Summer Fridays R&R. &R. Feeling it this week with the skincare. Anyways, I'm using this brush um, this silicone brush thingy from Amazon that I got a while ago. So I'm gonna let this do its thing. You guys are seeing a different side of me this week because I would never go no makeup with a face mask on camera, but here I am. Don't really care. And I'm gonna leave this on. And I think I'm gonna make some cookies, like the Halloween little Pillsbury cookies, because I'm feeling that. And we have some in the fridge, so let's make those and have a little skincare relaxation night. So we're making these. I'm very excited. These are low key, the best cookies ever. So my mom wants one, and I'm having two. Oh, you want two now? No one can resist the Pillsbury cookies. Okay, maybe I'll show you them when they're baked. <laughs> and these cookies just remind me of childhood because we used to eat these all the time. Oh God, guys, look what I just did. But. Matt actually bought these because he was craving them too. And then he left them here. So, find us keep us. This is a great night if I do say so myself. We got cookies. We got a face mask. Good, good morning, good morning, good morning. I shouldn't say morning because it's not morning. It's actually five minutes till noon. Woke up. Did some work, obviously, like I do every day. And now I'm going to do a workout. So, as I mentioned before... I have a Peloton bike, which we purchased during the first wave of the pandemic. And I've been really loving it because I used to spin all the time. Like that was my main workout. So I'm gonna do a quick like 20 minute workout. I love the quick 20 minute ones. It's just like get it done, feel accomplished. So I'm gonna do that. And then I was thinking I need to start either donating or selling some clothes because it's getting a little ridiculous, so I need to get that sorted. Might pick out some clothing items to sell on Depop. I think I'll update you guys, but yeah, let me show you guys. So the Peloton's really cool. That's me. Pages pick, Avi. And you go to classes. 
and there's so many classes. I want the pictures to load. Since I'm kind of tired today, I might just do like a little like house house vibe not so much hip-hop because i did hip-hop last time there are the pictures my favorite instructor is actually kendall tool she's the freaking best and i like to look at the song so this has like britney spears mm, Ooh, party in the usa this is a little too much for me right now playlist wise but i'm saving this for a day where i'm feeling more ready for that one i'm gonna go pick a ride do that quickly and see you guys later so that workout was really really good even though it was 20 minutes i feel so much better way more positive and on that note i just wanted to address something quickly not even sure if anyone is watching this at this point but if you are watching i feel like you're meant to hear this and i was meant to say it the past few weeks have been really tough really busy a lot has happened and it's out of our control and i've been in like kind of like a negative mind space i'm not gonna lie i've been feeling very uninspired with you know getting content for instagram i just haven't been feeling it i realized just doing one thing a day that will put you in a better mind space will just make you feel so much better and way more positive uh whether it be a workout taking a walk i don't i don't even like working out that much but even just thinking of one positive thing a day uh that's going for you will just help so much better and it's not only finding positivity in yourself but with the people um around you i personally have a close group of friends i keep it small because i have had people in the past that have put me down and let's be real if someone's putting you down they're not your friend i've cut people out of my life like that because it just wasn't working for me they know who they are it is what it is i just think of the positive things going for me i'm just having a job during this pandemic having my family having my boyfriend having my friends uh just thinking about those things just makes you feel so much better and just do something for yourself that makes you feel better and your day will be made anyways sorry i went on a tangent there but on that note let's eat some lunch your girl is starving it's literally one o'clock the day's been going by fast actually i don't look cute but that's just the theme of this vlog i feel and i'm hungry i don't know what to eat fridge lighting hello guys my zara order came ordered this on a whim but i really like these items online so i really hope i like them let's unbox them together zara is my weakness it comes in like a day not that expensive just you know love getting packages from them oh yeah so the first thing i got is this shacket but it actually has like a tie around the waist with some buttons like it kind of looks like a jacket more of but it's a shacket and i'm really excited to wear this with leather leggings and it's this beautiful olive green color so i'm so excited this was the most expensive item but i was willing to make the investment and i hope it looks good and if not i'll just return it because zara has free shipping next up i got this turtleneck bodysuit that looks really long hmm i don't know guys i'll try it on and we'll see um but basically it's this ribbed turtleneck bodysuit i've been looking for a plain turtleneck bodysuit for a while but they're all so expensive this one was 29 dollars. so pick this up hopefully it fits if not i'm just gonna return that i'm most concerned about this butt thing it's like very long um but we'll try it just to tuck this into jeans or skirts and then the last thing i picked up is just this beautiful mauvey light pink bodysuit zara bodysuits are my favorite I'm wearing a zara bodysuit right now in this burgundy color but again just another plain basic went for a lighter color just to you know spice it up a bit uh very excited about this too this was 39 so a little bit more expensive than the turtleneck which i'm surprised about but this has been in my cart for like weeks and i just got it because it was in there and i was getting that stuff so i was like whatever let's just do it so glad i picked those up i will try them on and if they work out i will be shooting them this weekend that was a nice little unboxing guys i love how this came in a day like i said it's just the best um highlight on my day i'm addicted to shopping but we knew that right yes i'm so happy it is thursday it's almost the end of the day it means it's almost friday and it's almost the weekend i'm ready and i'm gonna have a chill rest of the day because i'm not that busy 
and we love that so i'm gonna work from my bed if there's anything to do and do you guys want to see my outfit i feel like you don't really care um same sweatpants as before don't worry i washed them they're clean and just this black that's not black just this plain burgundy bodysuit from Zara. Like I said before, I just tucked it into the sweatpants. I'm wearing these fluffy slippers from Walmart, which is a dupe for the Ugg slippers. They're $19, super cute. And yeah, this is what I look like today. Looking fancier, looking fancier than most days. Working from home, I dressed up for y'all today. Hey babe, so it's actually Saturday, so I missed a day of vlogging, and I will show you why. See all those boxes? I packed all of those. Um, yesterday was a busy day at work with a new drop, and I had to pack all of that. But I did it pretty quickly, so these are my boxes, and I have to bring those to UPS soon i'm not going today and i didn't have time yesterday but um the reason why i have a full face of makeup and this is actually the first time you guys are seeing me with a full face of makeup all vlog this whole vlog is because my friend sam and i are shooting today we're actually going to get some content we're going to shoot a couple outfits i'm personally excited because i haven't gotten instagram content all week and that's something i usually do every single week so i have some outfits laid out i'll show you guys after but yeah, that's what we're doing today. Right now, I'm going to have some leftover sushi that we had yesterday. Need lipstick, so don't mind the choppy lips. But look at those eyes. You guys can't even see. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, and I did my hair. We're good today. We're, we're refreshed. But I'm going to eat some sushi, and we're going to have fun today. So this is basically what my room looks like when I plan outfits. I have three outfits planned. We're going to wear one and pack the other two. This is the first time we're actually ever going out and getting more than one outfit um but i'm super excited so i've tried all this on i know it looks good so i'm gonna wear one probably my new olive shacket and then pack the rest in a duffel bag and we're gonna have some fun i'm really excited it's a beautiful day can't wait hey guys i'm here with my friend sam my beautiful friend and we're shooting content we got coffee such a cute little place and we shot one look and now we're gonna change it to another look we're downtown show you guys it's basic downtown Queen Street and yeah we're having a cute little fall day stay tuned because she has really good luck <laughs> I love this tall option this is so cute I'm looking for like a half zip that's nice I like how it's like woolly mm. you know what I mean with the it looks warm and sudsy zipper. just like you <laughs> Ooh. Oh, this is the vibe this is the vibe all the home stuff for the home I don't have. Like, I just want to buy this cooler. Why? <laughs> it's so cute. This clip. <laughs> Get it together. Get it together, sis. You know what? I'm going to buy it. Are you actually? It's on sale. <laughs> oh, God. I need to get my shit You're together. insane. Even extra 50 off? Done. She's done. She sold. That looks kind of like the one you wanted. No, Shape wise. Thinker. I'm not thinking. I'm not thinking. This is really cute. I don't even know what this is, but I want to buy it. Why does it have hole? Is it an ashtray? Mm. And is that just? I don't know. All I right. Really That's cute. It is cute. I haven't been wearing it in years. Also, I haven't used my 2020 agenda. <laughs> Me either. 2020 is cancelled. It is like That's the vibe, guys. Little coaster. Mm -hmm. I want everything. It's decided that I'm getting this perfume and this one because it's on sale and we like this mirror a lot, even though it's not focusing. And Sammy's charging her phone. <laughs> Outfit number two, we're going for more of a dad look. Sammy's getting a picture too. I'm gonna try. She's gonna try. She says she doesn't have what it takes today, but I know she does. I'm here just for photography purposes. That's a lie, we're doing this together. Anyways, Queen, ugh, Queen Street is a vibe today. Very nice. And we already got a coffee, but I could go for another coffee. I'm down. We're always down for coffee. Okay, guys, funny story. So 
Sam and I used to work together, that's how we met. And literally, we start work at nine. At seven, this girl would text me and say, so are we getting coffee when we get in the office? I haven't even had my first coffee, but I always said yes, so we always got coffee every day. Starbucks is bae. Starbucks was bae. We both had our money on our cards and we would go literally every day to Starbucks. And we miss those days. But look at us now. But look at us now, we're thriving. Who would have thought? <laughs> Not me. <laughs> we are done for the day. We got all our shots in. I'm wearing this like random blazer thing from Zara. But we got really good pictures. Um, and now we're just gonna chill and wrap up our day because that was really fun. Totally realized I forgot to film an outro, so I'm just gonna do that now as I'm editing this video. I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching. This vlog was very fun to film. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you want to see more vlogs in the future or just more regular fashion videos as always. But guys, thank you so much. I had the most fun and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.